So yesterday I went and stopped at Total Wine uh, to uh, pick up a couple of beers and I decided to do another taste test. I did a taste test about a month ago, did some IPAs and pale ales and everyone told me I was an idiot. I shouldn't have jumped right to an IPA. I should definitely have started off with some pale ales and work my way up. But in any case, not a fan of IPAs. Something I am a fan of recently though is um, Milk Stout Nitro from Left Hand Brewery. I love it. It's so, so yummy. It's definitely different. It's a dark beer. Um, kind of has the coffee and chocolate notes. And uh, anyways, that is a milk stout. And so I did some research and found that stouts, porters, it, there's, there's different varieties, different blends. And so I'm gonna do some taste testing. So here is the, 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 the stock that I got. So there's the, the milk stout nitro that I love. This is the regular milk stout, same brewery. This is the blackjack porter. This is a stone brand coffee milk stout. And this is a vanilla porter. So that is what I'm gonna be doing taste testing on. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna start with the one that I know I already like. So, chocolatey, coffee, it's like mocha, mocha. So now we're gonna go right to the milk stout, regular milk stout, minus the nitro. Not as creamy. Has more of a sharper finish. This is the blackjack porter. More of a beer flavor. Less coffee, more beer. Interesting. Still good, it just has more of a beer flavor. Different brand, a different brewery. This is Stone Coffee Milk Stout. Whoa. Not good. No, no, no. Vastly different. This has more of a coffee flavor. This, is, this tastes like coffee. Totally. Ale brewed with roasted coffee beans. This is a coffee, totally, a coffee milk stout. Okay. And then lastly, this is the Vanilla Porter. Brewed with real vanilla beans. Ooh, I like that one. Taste the vanilla, but definitely different flavor. Different flavor. Have to say, I like the 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 milk stouts the best. The blackjack porter though was good as well. So that's the nitro right there, the milk stout nitro, and that's that cascading effect, and it's building this really rich, creamy head. It looks like. Falling dirt. Isn't that's that cool. So that's how the nitro and, and actually the, the left-handed ones are all say that they should be poured in, into a glass. The nitro says pour hard so that you, it sloshes and it kind of forces the, the bubbles to come up. To this ni that. nice rich, try, rich whipped cream head. Look at that. Mm. See, oh, oh, try that now. Try that now. It's like a chocolate whipped cream on top. It's like chocolate whipped cream on top. <clears throat> You taste it? I only taste the cream. I only taste the cream. <laughs> so I've got the Milk Stout next to the Milk Stout Nitro, and I have to say that I like the Milk Stout Nitro better. It's a little creamier. It's very similar taste, but this has a little, just, it's creamier, and it has that, it has that uh, thick head. And of all the beers, I have to say that the Milk Stouts I like the best. The Stone Coffee Milk Stout um, is definitely like coffee. Like it tastes like coffee, black coffee and beer. Um, so it's not, not to say that I don't like it, just vastly different than the other ones.